Humpty Monkey. Humpty Monkey. No music. No music. Hey everyone, thanks for joining. You are now tuned in to another episode of Tasty Tuesdays with Tamika. Today I'll teach you how we make up vegan barbecue ribs and collard greens. So come on in and let's get started. For this recipe, you'll need some crushed peppers, a hungry monkey all-purpose seasoning, jalapeno. Of course, you'll need your collard greens. Um, you'll need to rinse them before chopping and cooking. You need a large onion, a few garlic cloves, um, we're using our Better Than Bouillon, no chicken base. It's going to bring you lots of flavor. You'll also need the unsalted vegetable stock, two cans of jackfruit, some barbecue sauce, and we have yucca, which will act as our bone. You'll want to first cut up your jalapeno, onion, and garlic. Then we'll season, stir, and brown. You can also add in a bit of soy sauce. And now's a good time to add in your no chicken bouillon base. Now let's add in about half of the vegetable broth. While that simmers, we'll need to go and prepare our collard greens. So first, you need to remove the stems from each leaf, and then we're gonna take it as a whole, we stack it, and we roll everything together before cutting it, I wanna say, um, vertically, horizontally, whatever direction this is, well, um, you get the message. Our onions are browned, so now we can go ahead and add in the chopped collard greens into the same pot. Now we can add in the rest of the vegetable stock, and we're also going to put about a cup or cup and a half of water before covering and letting it cook. While our collard greens are cooking, let's cook the jackfruit in about a half cup of water and a cup and a half of barbecue sauce. Now let's skin and slice the yucca in preparation for our bones. Our jackfruit is cooked. Now we're just going to transfer this into a for you pan and place in the oven at 350 degrees for about 30 to 35 minutes. Now back to our greens. They look done, so we can go ahead and take these off of the fire. Our jackfruit has finished baking. At this point, you can eat it, shred it as is, or um, it's optional to add the bone and wrap into rice paper, as I am doing here. I've wrapped my yucca bone into a rice paper individually, then I place it onto the center and wrap another rice sheet on top of the yucca bone and the meaty portion. So you repeat those steps of wrapping for as many jackfruit ribs as you'd like to make. You just seasoned it a bit on top. Then we'll add our barbecue sauce before placing into a bowl of flour. And then we'll go ahead and deep fry them. You want them to be a bit charred because the more charred, the more chewier and closer it is to meat and texture. After we fry, we want to cover them in a bit of barbecue sauce before placing back in the oven at 350 degrees for about 25 minutes. And this is your final result. And now for my favorite part, the tasting test. Let's zoom in. Mmm.
But okay, guys, it was nice cooking with you. Be sure to tune in again next week for another episode of Tasty Tuesdays with Tamika. Bye-bye. Hey guys, if you're watching this on YouTube, be sure to hit that subscribe button below and give us a thumbs up.